Hey, it's Dorleen, and today I'm talking about some really quick tags that I did for Valentine's Day. Um, I did, a, or my idea was to do a stamp cluster, so I pulled out a bunch of hearts and Valentine's Day kind of wording and things like that for these tags. So I started off thinking I was going to use this love coupon for the base, but then I realized it wasn't really like a coupon. Now I know it's really more background, but that's why I decided to use this um, kind of like a journal box area. So I have three tags I need to make. I did do four because I thought if I really messed up on one, I would at least have an extra. And I really just pulled out my reds, my pinks, and again, all these like kind of love related, Valentine's Day related um, stamps. So I um, am making these for my daughter and my daughter-in-law. I purchased um, some lotion, so I was just going to do a little package. No, no big deal. But um, I had a lot of fun with this. So like I said, I pulled out a lot of different pinks, uh, reds, and I just kind of did a bunch of stamps. This particular little one is the I Love You in ASL. And if you know me, uh, my parents are deaf, so that's a big uh, symbol in our life, uh, multi-generational, right? Uh, but I didn't show you every single tag because basically I did the same thing, or at least I used the same stamps on every one. Um, you can tell just by the placement on some of the stamps. Obviously, the placements are a little bit different. Um, this little sentiment right here, I started using this tin pail, which is a very, very light gray. I didn't realize it wasn't really going to show up. So you'll see me later do it or stamp it in, I want to say black. It might be this gray that I use. But um, so you'll see me do that twice. But again, what I did on one stamp, I pretty much did on the other, or excuse me, one tag, I pretty much did on the other. And I just kind of had fun with it. Now, going back, or if I do this again, I think I'll probably give it a little bit more thought. This was totally last minute. Um, even though I had bought those lotions for the girls <laughs> weeks ago, I kind of forgot about it. And, um, you know, with Super Bowl weekend, I knew I wasn't going to have a lot of time to really focus. So I thought those were really fun. Um, it's amazing how many stamps you realize you have. I haven't used those heart stamps in I couldn't even tell you how long. So it was really fun to pull them out and actually use them. And then what I ended up doing is I ended up cutting them apart and um, again, making them into tags. So this lovely stamp, uh, I wish I would have done more like how, I, how I'm doing it now, kind of sideways or... Um, uh, Vertical, yeah, vertical, um, and did it more like kind of subway art-like, but um, that really turned out really cute, and I like that. So when I cut them all separately, I ended up using the gold ink pad to also um, uh, put ink around the edges, and you'll see that in the final project. But I hope you like this video. Give me a thumbs up if you do. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, and I'll have a link to my blog in the comment section, or excuse me, in the box down below if you need more information. See you later. Bye.